In this video, we will demonstrate how to give an intramuscular injection to a lizard. However, there are a few things to remember before we get started. Make sure you have carefully read the medication label and understand the prescription instructions, including what volume of medication to give, how often the medication should be given, and how long the treatment should continue. You should also find out if there are any special storage requirements for the medication, such as keeping the medicine in the freezer. To avoid contamination, be sure to wash your hands before giving your pet an injection. It is very important that lizards be housed properly with a temperature gradient appropriate for the species because drug absorption, distribution, metabolism, and excretion are all affected by body temperature. Historically, injecting medications in the back half of the body has been avoided due to the presence of a renal portal system which directs blood from the tail and hind legs to the kidneys. While the significance of this system is still unknown in many species, unless there is some other reason not to, it is recommended that injections be given in the front legs of the lizard. Give intramuscular injections into the biceps, shown in green in this photo, or triceps, shown in blue. These muscles are present between the elbow and shoulder. Injections should be made between the scales as opposed to through the scales. If necessary, Use an appropriately sized towel to wrap the body. Treat larger or more aggressive species with caution. You may need the assistance of a helper to ensure that the lizard is under control to prevent painful bites and scratches. Give the injection in muscles in the front limb between the elbow and shoulder by inserting the needle between the scales at a 45 degree angle, aiming for the middle of the muscle. Once your needle has been inserted into the muscle, draw back slightly on the plunger to ensure that you have not entered a blood vessel. If you do not see blood, give the injection. If you see blood, take the needle out and retry in another area of the muscle or in the opposite front arm. After you withdraw the needle, place your finger over the site of insertion for a few seconds to prevent leaking of the medicine. When the next treatment is due, use the opposite front leg and keep alternating sides with each treatment. Please note that chameleons can often have a localized color change to the skin following the injection. This usually resolves within a few hours or days, but could last weeks. Be sure to wash your hands after handling your lizard and return used needles to your veterinarian for safe disposal. If you have questions about how to give your lizard medications, please contact the clinic. Thanks for watching.